for Tuesday. Before that, however, have to deal with a fire weather warning out to Itasca County, Aiken County, and into the Brainerd Lakes region. Near critical fire weather conditions for much of northeastern Minnesota, including Duluth and into northern Wisconsin. So just be careful if you're burning anything out there today. Low pressure system to our north will track east, bringing that cold front on through. And with it, some isolated showers possible. But the main story will be knocking us down into fall-like temperatures in the lower 60s on Tuesday. High pressure fills into our south. Then we'll see another cold front sneak on through on Wednesday. Wednesday afternoon and evening time. That will also cool us down a bit into Thursday after another mild day possible on Wednesday, though not quite as mild as today. How mild are we talking today? Upper 70s, lower 80s possible, south of the Twin Ports, a little cooler into Cook County with those winds out of the south off, off of Lake Superior. Then going on into our Tuesday, we'll get up to the upper 50s, lower 60s out there region wide. That's right around average for this time of year. Then on Wednesday, we'll end up seeing lower 70s possible in northern Wisconsin, east central Minnesota, and then into the Twin Ports and points north upper 60s likely for high temperatures so that's still a little mild out there but not quite as mild as today here's that cold front that will cool us on down producing cloud cover as well as some isolated showers out there it's only about a 20 percent chance so most of us stay dry speaking of staying dry this will likely be the second driest september on record here in duluth then going on into tomorrow we'll end up seeing some partly cloudy skies in the afternoon followed by some mostly cloudy skies on wednesday morning which we will end up clearing out a bit on wednesday afternoon afternoon. Now for wind speeds out there, this is why we have near critical or critical fire weather conditions. Winds out of the southwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour, gusting to 30 miles per hour today and overnight tonight. Then into our Tuesday, still looking like northwest winds will be keeping us dry and keeping uh, those fire weather conditions prevalent out of the northwest at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Now today, 78 in Duluth, 76 downtown, 77 on Grand Rapids and 70 in Grand Marais. Still a beautiful day out there. 81 in Spooner and 80 in Ashland. Mostly sunny skies throughout the day and then some isolated afternoon thunderstorms and seven day forecast tomorrow we drop down into the 60s for the rest of the seven day so a nice change in the right direction towards normal here keeping us in the 60s but we also stay dry through